so Pioneer 2, which is versus Impica flows in her jar dance, uh, was one of our trials presented here at the ADA uh, just today. Uh, it's part of the Pioneer program, and we were looking at comparators versus really all the relevant oral and even injectable therapies out there in type 2 diabetes patients. So Pioneer 2, we went against the leading SGLT2 inhibitor, uh, and fortunately, as you saw the results, we did show a significant uh, A1C reduction at 26 weeks versus Jardiance, as well as significant uh, weight benefits uh, that were not statistically significant, but were very relevant for that patient population and, and that amount of weight loss. So we're very encouraged by these results and uh, they were received very well here today in, in uh, San Francisco. No, I think a lot of it had to do with, uh, with the study design of the trial going out to 52 weeks and certainly have dropouts in each arm. And if you look at the primary estimate, it actually takes in consideration rescue therapy. So if those individuals drop out of the GLP-1 arm, they're probably going to get a rescue therapy that doesn't help their weight. And vice versa, in the SGLT2 arm, if they drop out, they could actually go on a GLP-1. So there, there could be some of that at play. And, and really, the, the weight reductions in both arms were very nice and, and a positive message that, uh, that you know, three to four kilograms of weight reduction. I think the, the long term, the 52-week result kind of speaks to the durability of oral semaglutide, that, that patients actually did stay on this therapy. They did adhere to the dosing uh, of this in the morning time. Uh, and continue to see the good results both with A1C and weight throughout the entire 52 weeks.